All right, and hence my love of snow. I'm always looking for those two identical flakes. That's how I injured myself here, looking for twin snowflakes. All right, Great Falls, a little chilly out there, all the way down to 11. Northeast wind at about six miles per hour. Feels like one above zero. Hello, January. And Helena, that picture uh, from Geyser actually towards the high woods, obviously a little late in updating. Helena, still nice to see some light in the sky about a quarter after six, 24 degrees. North wind at six miles per hour. So yeah, some pretty chilly stuff has moved into the state here through the course of the weekend. We had some wind chills way northeast Montana, all the way down close to 20, 25 below at uh, times this week. End and wind speeds 10, 15, 18 miles per hour out there. So when you have uh, single digits and teens with a wind of that speed, that's going to do something to the wind chill. We have a wind chill factor. Uh, there you can see uh, the radar. Nothing here across most of the state. Now, uh, the snowbirds getting the snow. Look down Southern California, around Las Vegas, uh, Phoenix even, seeing some flakes of snow close to Scottsdale, Tucson. So those snowbirds that uh, fled Montana getting away from the snow, actually looking at uh, some of the snow. We also have a little in the way of some snow extending from almost Colorado all the way to the East Coast there. So there is some snow falling in parts of the country. Now in Montana, all right, there might be a little snow in the mountains here uh, this week. Nothing tomorrow, no, day very similar to today for Wednesday, though, a little snow down Manita Pass, up over the Lookout Pass area. Maybe a little snow Wednesday off of the Rocky Mountain front, but most of the state still not seeing much, if any, snow. Thursday, again, a little snow west of the divide into Friday, but ooh, look at this. Friday night, maybe a little snow around Helen up through Great Falls and Lewistown into Saturday morning. Little snow, but it's something. Uh, Sunday looking partly cloudy and then heading into next week around Tuesday and Wednesday. Tuesday is Groundhog Day. Everybody's uh, the, every meteorologist's favorite holiday. A good chance at seeing some snow. Uh, snowfall amounts accumulation uh, into the Sierra. We could see five to eight feet of snow uh, here over the next few days. That is absolutely incredible. Way high up above about uh, 9,000 feet, but the Tetons getting some snow, the Sawtooth getting some snow, Northwest Montana getting some snow, but little to nothing east of the Continental Divide. Tonight, another chilly night. Many locations down into the single digits, even close to or below zero in uh, northeast Montana here. Wind chills 10, 15 below. Lewistown at five. There's showdown at one below. And around the Helena area, single digits for most locations. For tomorrow, Arctic high pressure off towards the northeast, so it will be colder the closer you get to that high. 16 in Glasgow, 31 in Missoula for Wednesday looking at partly cloudy skies and here's some warmer air temperatures getting back close to average into the mid 30s for Thursday a little boundary here separating some colder air off north uh, from some 40s down to the south and then heading into Friday this is when we may see just a little snow Lewistown Helena maybe a few flakes as far north as Great Falls later in the day Bozeman Butte America Dillon could see some snow here on Friday. Here's the seven day forecast for Helena and uh, there you can see those temperatures on the upswing here slowly and we may top out near 40 this coming weekend. Some snow showers again Friday night into Saturday. Maybe the hills around town could see an inch or two. Uh, we'll have to watch next Tuesday and for Great Falls. A chilly day tomorrow, slowly warming up later this week. A little snow shower activity Friday and Saturday, but the beginning of February, I'm seeing some changes. All right, thanks, Curtis.